Hey there, it's Iron here, and we are back on Farming Simulator 2015, and I am here to show you the wishing well. And if you're not sure exactly why the wishing well is important, well, this is on the Bjorn home map, and if you're collecting gold coins like this, then what happens when you're done collecting the gold coins? Well, if you walk up to the wishing well, or it says the mysterious well, you stare into the gaping maw of the well and get the weird feeling that it hungers for shiny things. 100 shiny things, to be exact. That's right, well, this is where you go. If you find all those shiny coins and you don't know what to do with them, then you put them here. So I am going to show you how to find it, where it's at, where it's located, and if you haven't watched my video on how to find the gold coins in uh, Farming, Later, Farming Simulator 2015, then I'll put a link right up above here and you can go watch that too. Uh, how to find all the, lo the gold coins, how to uh, reap the benefits of it in your single player and in multiplayer. Yep, you can reap the benefits in multiplayer if you know how. All right, so hold on and I'll be right back. All right, hey there, it's Iron, and we are back. And what I've done is I have collected the first 10 gold coins. Again, if you uh, have never uh, done the, the gold coins and or you just uh, don't know how to find them or whatever, go back and watch the, the, the tutorial link up above and uh, from the gold coins and I'll show you how to do that. But for this one, what do you do with it after you've collected all these wonderful gold coins? Well, at first you think it's a trick, but uh, if you look in the bottom left-hand corner of the map, you'll see field number 35 and number 40. And if you go to the very uh, last coin, all the way far left bottom, uh, just to the left of uh, the number 40 in the field 40, that's where we're heading to. And that's in that area is the elusive, uh, mysterious wishing well. And you'll want to know about that. So let's just follow along and I'll show you what to do. And um, then you'll be ready to cash in as well. All right, so let's just uh, get going here on our trusty old tractor. There's a couple of different shortcuts that you can make. Uh, if you bring up the map, you can just kind of look and go. I am going to take a few little shortcuts through the fields. You'll want to be careful, though, because you can uh, you can run into some issues. You can do some off-roading and stuff, but it's fairly safe. We're just going to cut across here the field 28 and the field 33. We'll catch this winding road and take it on down, like right here. Watch. All right. There you go. Not too bad. So let's dismiss the map and once you know where to go and how to get there it really doesn't take you that long of course on the tractor here we can we can cut off a little bit if we want to you don't want to wreck into the vehicle so they will this particular tractor I have is a pretty decent one at least it's going faster than these Sunday drivers no watch out oh almost wrecked all right, so you can see we are coming up here. Let's go ahead and take a right. And field number 40 is right up here. So if you go out there about where the buy symbol is, we can get right on the number 40. And if we just head it straight that way, we would run into the coin and the wishing well. The only problem is, it's kind of hard to drive a tractor, so you can get up on this road over here. And if you follow it around, there's a little secret area. So you would never probably go out and find this place, or find the wishing well, if you weren't actually looking for the gold coins. The first time I actually picked up all the gold coins, I didn't even pay attention to the well. It wasn't until later, and I was talking with Dead Bob, and he was telling me about it. 
So if you come up here, there's a little house or whatever. And there's an actual coin in this area as well. Uh, but if you just follow it on around, you come down here. And we can get out. So uh, as you can see, um, hold on, let me pull up the map. You can see we're standing right above the gold coin there. Uh, so it's it's right here. You pick up that one, and of course when you have all of them, you'll just come up here and you'll just once you just approach it, it'll throw them in the well. And uh, don't forget to watch my other video for uh, what else you get. You get a lot of stuff for it, and you can use this in single player and multiplayer. But there's just a trick if you want to use this in multiplayer. So watch my other video and you'll see that then. Alright, this is Iron, and until next time, we'll, we'll see you on Farming Simulator 2015. Don't forget to leave a comment, leave a like, subscribe. Uh, if you have any questions about the game, leave that too, and maybe I'll make a video for you, just like I did for Francois when he asked about how to uh, create and join multiplayer servers. Alright, until next time, this is Iron, and we will see ya.